it's time to get creative. So what I have prepared for you here is a bunch of words from different tweets that we use for liquid hacks. But what you're gonna do is make one tweet. So there is extra stuff on here that you don't need. Uh -oh. You wanna create something that is cohesive. It's announcing something. It's going to have a purpose of why it's being tweeted. So it's not noise. Yeah. Okay, so obviously, first and foremost, you're gonna have to put Team Liquid up there. You know, that's how all tweets start. I can't really get too creative with that. But now, looking at everything that we have here, a Liquid Hacks update and applications, okay. So I feel like Liquid Hacks update and Liquid Hacks coming at you tomorrow is redundant. So it's gonna be one or the other of these. And I'm gonna say that we're, we're talking about the applications extended. That's what this tweet is going to be about for me as a as a fan that's interested in the hackathon and maybe I felt like I was a little too late. I would have been really excited to learn about this. But since there's a link, I always think of links at the very end. So I'm going to put this right here, Liquid Hacks update. Boop. Uh, what if it's bring your big applications extended? No, see, that doesn't make sense. Oh, but bring your. Oh, OK. See, I'm not very good with the emotes. So I'm gonna say, bring your big brain, bam, to like add a little little spice, a little flavor to it. Nope, nope, I don't like it anymore. Where, where am I messing up right now? You're doing good so far with the way you're thinking. Okay. So um, maybe just look at the other pieces on the board and see if those might be part of the, the post. I do see that there's a lot of emojis here. What is the importance of emojis? Why have them in your, your social media posts? So if your post is too text heavy, mm -hmm. it becomes a bit harder to read. Emojis help break up the text. They help point direction. So you know that you need to sign up, but something like an arrow tells you, it prompts you to go. Yeah. The same way how as humans, we see an exit door and it has a sign and it has a, a person. Okay. And you're like, ah, this is the exit. So we think in symbols and we think in signs and emojis help with that whole side of everything. Okay. So with that being said then, uh, applications extended to October 24th signups here. I'm going to I'm going to put this thing right here in front of that because that kind of reminds me of an applications thingy. Bring your big brain. Uh, both will be less. So that doesn't make sense right there. I do like this and I know that's something that Team Liquid had for their hackathon. So I'm actually going to put that the very start right there to kind of grab people's eyes and then bam, here's a bit of information. You break that up with a little emoji and more information and then a little spicy outro right there. Bring your big brain, bam. So your final answer. This is my final answer. All right, so you're very, very close. <gasps> Ooh, okay. Um, with the loading bar, we had loading as the first line. Oh, duh, okay, okay. yeah. So it kind of goes into it that way. That Liquid sense. Hacks update here is correct. Um, and then you were right about how the link should be the last thing before oh. as like kind of like closing it out. Yes. So bring your big brain is actually from a different post. Oh. But we have a calendar emoji to state the events. Okay. So this is when we had announced that these are the event dates mm -hmm. and that applications had also been extended. And the whole process of mathing it out, we're 70% of the way there. So we're getting very, very close to the live date. Awesome. Yeah, no, I, I like this. I, I don't even know why in my mind I was like, oh, you can't have event dates and applications in the same, but you could. Just because yeah. it's a few dates doesn't mean that it's too cluttered and you break it up by having these emojis here. And now that you've showed me this loading bar, I can kind of understand how this is something that was like, you know, just a small addition to the, the series of tweets, but it added not just a little bit of creativity, but something that people could expect, something that they knew was going to be there. So anytime Team Liquid posted and you would catch this, like this would catch your eye, you knew it was about the hackathon. Correct. Wow, there's a lot that goes into crafting a tweet and I can only imagine how much goes into crafting a whole campaign. It's a lot of thinking up front at first, but once you get into that flow and that cadence, it kind of just all reveals itself over time. Yeah, and, and I had a lot of fun doing it, but I'm also really interested into seeing, you know, how successful were these tweets for you and how are you kind of able to like review it? Well, let's get into it.